welcome. If you guys are new, my name's Maya. Go ahead and click subscribe button and do not forget to turn on the bell so you never miss the new videos. If you guys are remainder subscribers, welcome back. So good to see you again. And guess what? I'm not on a boat anymore. I'm just kidding. I just got back home from the Royal Caribbean cruise vacation and it is a lot of fun. And I did get a little head dizzy while the boat is moving. I usually get seasick sometimes, but I do not want to talk about it. But anyway, you guys may remember I did the vlog that was about a week ago that I post a video for you guys and now this is mine I show you guys we did the two day trips to Canada one to St. John and Nova Scotia I don't know if I said this correct but anyway I did got stuff from Amazon away that I will show you at the end of this video so if you are ready Back to the Canada. <laughs> I really love these. This kind of reminds me of the SpongeBob thing. So we're at the museum that we are about to meet in Norwich. So let's see what this is all about. Mm -hmm. 
And this is the chair from the Titan. That's called desk chair. Like that way. Look like a fantasy or ball in my or something like that. That's how you help with fire. But there were women involved in fire watch pursuits. Mm -hmm. There were women involved in administrative roles and administrative duties in the military. There were some women that were in charge of communications as well. But the biggest thing they did, this is the Royal Canadian Navy in 1939, 13 ships. In six years, thanks to women of, the, of what we dub as the greatest generation. They worked in the dockyards, not only in Halifax, but in Picto, and Lunenburg, and uh, Montreal, and Quebec, and Ontario, even in the UK. They worked all over. And in six years, we went from 13 to well over 400. Wow. We were the third largest Allied Navy in the world, only behind the UK and the United States. And this is from a population with roughly 12 million people, of which, combined with the men and women that served and the women in industry, that was 2 million people taken out of the equation. So that's pretty impressive. But these women were riveters, welders, steam fitters, um, uh, uh, grinders, elect electricians. These women went from, here's how you put on your bandana, <laughs> so you don't tear your scalp out, because they did in a few cases, to yeah, throw me another ribbon. And then you're putting down the big welding goggles and you're doing the thing. It's staggering what these women went from overnight. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, I went around. Well, how was it? Oh, that was good. Mm -hmm. That's good, it's light, it's crispy, <laughs> got a nice sugar and a uh, cinnamon. Mm. This is a 10 out of 10 for me. I like this. What is that? You, is that mashed potatoes? No, it's cheese. It's called poutine. It's a Canadian, it's a Canadian side dish, french fries, gravy. 
and cheese. Mm, Canadian gotcha. cheese. So I'm going to try it and see how it tastes. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. That seems interesting. Yeah. Was it good? Bad? Thumbs up? Thumbs down? Yeah, the cheese. The cheese gives it a unique flavor. Mm. It's definitely unique. The can can mm -hmm. definitely a, a unique flavor. <laughs> You guys see, there's a little cupcake. I got vanilla gelate. <laughs> it kind of reminded me of um, the trip we went to Italy. That's what it tastes like. Uh, it is really amazing and delicious, obviously. <laughs> The original ship stopped and they went through the paperwork, whatever they had to do to get in here and so on. <laughs> Now up in here in the hill you see three red lights it's called the three sister lamps on the other side of the on the other side of those lamps are white. If you're coming into the harbor at night and you see red instead of white, then you're off kilter a bit and your ship has to be St. Vincent's Girls School closed a few years ago. Now we we have to turn right right here because of construction. But on black, you're more than welcome because there's lots of available ladies there. And uh, I would say now that those doors have been repainted many times over, but that little historical thing still exists even though the people up there sign right there that means stop the bus so uh, that cross up means don't run her over <laughs> uh, yes 
there. Oh, there's a couple of people there, isn't there? Isn't that something? Now you're. Now as we proceed down here, we're going to go up into the uh, the park of the city, Rockwood Park. And wow, there's a lot in there uh, horticulturally to see, uh, but there's not, you know, you may not see much of it today, but you'll see some. Uh, and also, as we go across the overpass here, you'll see the highway that goes throughout New Brunswick. If you go to the right, you'll end up in the city of Moncton. And beaver. 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 If you want to get off right now, because we're tied up in traffic, you can, but we take the bus right over to the other side. There's a pink sign. Okay. Wow. Usually she give me free beer at Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> oh, how good of them? Oh yeah, you can see the commercial break here. Oh yeah, yeah, it's not free. You gotta buy, uh, you gotta buy the beer. It's the day you operate it as a bar. But they you can get things to eat or you can shop or and then you can walk through the pedway and go into Brunswick Square and do whatever you want in there. And the ship will still be there when you come out. And it's only like a block and a half walk back to the boat. So yeah. It is a lot of fun, and one of the best part is the tour bus and shopping, and I get to try the beaver tail, which is absolutely amazing, and I wanted to come back someday. And of course, I did got some stuff right here. I got two postcards in Canada and how it affects, and some. Two guy maps. This is St. John and like I said, Navas Navascata. There you go. If I said it incorrectly, just leave a comment below. Also, I did the, get to try this delicious cookie dough bites and cinnamon. Well, I actually open it. I mean, maybe I'll just have one. Not bad, but it tastes really good. I give it 10 out of 10. Yeah, I really need to try it. It's, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, it's good. And finally, I got this cute keychain. To, it's the bear that is a maple leaf. It says Canada on it, and it does have the white stones. It's so pretty cute, and I love it. Well, anyway, that is it for this video. If you guys do enjoy it, hit that thumbs up, leave the comments below, and yeah. I hope to see y'all real soon. In the next video, you guys have a terrific day. Love y'all so much.